Greetings everyone, I am Prince B, back again with some more of me this time, if you couldn't tell by the thumbnail and the title. We have the Triforce of Wisdom duo, uh, helping to fill up our Zelda collection a little more. Oh, after this we'll only be missing Ganon, who is currently, as of recording this, not available in the US. Uh, and I'm not doing imports right now, so no Ganon. We'll get to him eventually though, I'm sure. But for now, the star of the show is Princess Zelda and Sheik, bearers of the Triforce of Wisdom from Zelda lore. Uh, and just a little background info, I've had Sheik since uh, midway through June, actually. Had her for a while, about a month, not opened. Uh, just because I've been waiting to get a Zelda to open them with, I knew I wanted to do them as a duo. Uh, but I kept holding off on Zelda because she is fairly common here in the U.S. When I say fairly, I mean almost any store you'll walk in and find at least one. But as of late, I've been finding her less and less. Uh, my local GameStop only had this one, actually. Uh, and uh, even my Best Buy and my Target, they only had about three each. So... I don't know if that she's going to be the next one to go rare or if she's just somewhat if she's just taking a dip in stock and then she's going to come back up to being as common as Smash Peach but who knows for now uh and also Sheik uh fairly uncommon I had to pick her up at Toys R Us which is quite a way out of my way uh there's no Toys R Us really close to me. Uh, so that she, when I saw her, I picked her up. Uh, but that's those two. And uh, let's get started with Princess Zelda. I'm going to open her. And... Here we have her. Uh, for being so common, I think she looks really well. I mentioned uh, that I was wrong about colored supports. She has a purple one right here. Uh, there we go. But from where you'll probably have her positioned, you can't even really see it. This is how I'd probably position her. Uh, she's got good detail on her dress, uh, the painted stuff, and there's also some like textured stuff. Uh, and I know a lot of people are upset like about her hair or her face or something I think her face looks okay uh, her hair is not the greatest thing it could be a little bit better but overall I'd say for considering how common she is um, or was she has some really good detail overall uh, very glad to finally add her to my collection and next up is the Silent Ninja, the Sheik, the quote, uh, the last of the Sheikah, Sheik, uh, and here we go. Finally free from the box. Longest box to Amiibo I've had. Uh, she's got the clear support and she's got good level of detail too. You got the texture on her uh, boots and on her uh, suit up here. She's got her little knife there. Uh, her hair is, for some reason, poking straight out. I don't know if she's in a wind tunnel or something when they decided to take the pose, but that's kind of weird. Uh, other than that though, the hands aren't monstrously huge or anything. Uh, I've seen some polytennas with really big hands. Uh, but anyways, uh, you can see the emblem there. Overall, I'd say Sheik has a good level of detail too. Again, they're not necessarily the most detailed amiibo, but they're still pretty well detailed uh, when you consider the price of these things. So that's the Triforce of Wisdom duo, all opened and ready to display. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time for some more Amiibo videos.